talk to me about um, making your start against Norfolk State, how you felt coming out. Uh, yeah, I thought all week I was prepared. I mean, I know Tyler didn't practice all week, so I kind of got all the reps, so I was ready for that. And in game time, when they told me I was getting the start, I was, had to mentally get ready for that, so I did. And just going out there, I just felt confident, you know, just in our who I had around me, just to put it on their shoulders and just to trust in them so I didn't have to do too much. Did you imagine yourself having as good a game as you did? Uh, no, I don't think anybody did, actually, not even myself. But knowing that I capable to do that, that's good to uh, show that we can have people step up at different positions. So I think that's key for us. Okay. Uh, talk to me about getting the red shirt last year and how uh, much you thought it may have benefited you. Oh, uh, yeah, I think any red shirt for just everybody allows them just to uh, get bigger, stronger, and faster and just, just continue to uh, learn the playbook. I think that was mainly it, and just improving on the things I needed to. It's just what I got done during that red shirt year. Okay. Are you ready to go again this week if Tyler can't? Oh, yeah, if Tyler can't go, just whenever I'll be ready. Just whenever my name is called, I'll just go out there. Mm -hmm. And then thinking about the future of this program, uh, do you see yourself continuing the success that we've had in recent years? In oh, future? yeah, hopefully just when, other, when people graduate, the next people in line can just come in and step up and just keep the same pace and just try even do better and just keep the program going.